for me. I used to think that Ezra was counting on me to protect Lothal. The planet and the people he cared for so much. But one day, I realized there was more to it. There was something else I was meant to do. Ezra's out there somewhere, and it's time to bring him home. Luke Skywalker was the last known Jedi in the year 34 ABY, and saw the destruction of his new Jedi Order at the hands of his nephew, Ben Solo, in 28 ABY. The bounty hunter Din Djarin would locate the child around 9 ABY and is on a mission to return him to his Khan. Assuming Din completes this mission by locating Ahsoka Tano, we now have Ahsoka in possession of a child around the same time Luke creates his new order. However, Luke states his order was full of students when its destruction occurred. Ahsoka claims to no longer be a Jedi, and surely she would already be the rank of master at this time period. With other known force users in the galaxy such as Ezra Bridger, Cal Kestis, I believe Ahsoka Tano has created her own new order, not of the Jedi or the Sith way. Many call this the Grey Jedi. Ahsoka follows her own path, and perhaps she feels the path is one worthy of teaching apprentices. If she located Ezra with Sabine, and then maybe was able to find Cal Kestis who would be in his 40s and assuming he survived his journeys to this point, she would have a good start to a council. This would also explain why Luke Skywalker would claim to be the last Jedi knowing that Ahsoka's new order is a different path than his. I find it hard to believe Luke would not know about Ahsoka, and even more that Ahsoka would not seek out a Skywalker with her history with Anakin. She would want to know the final fate of Darth Vader. So, deep in the jungles of the planet Corvus, I believe stands a new temple, one built brick by brick by Ahsoka Tano, and one to face the last of the Imperial Remnant, and to help her allies on Mandalore. Stay tuned next week for my last theory on the Mandalorian, where I go through why Din Djarin is being set up to become the Mandalore and unite the clans under one banner. <laughs>